Hey guys. Hey, last video out. I made a stencil for the 2.5 square bill. So I thought today we're going to go ahead and paint one of these and we'll use the stencil that I made. Stick with me. All right. First thing we're going to do, we're going to use our base coat and that's going to be the opaque white. Get a good base coat of white. As always, that makes all of our colors look better. There we go. That's all it takes, just a base coat. Let's clean the gun out. We'll start on with our colors. All right. Now, as to what pattern we're going to paint. Kind of going through the Bass Pro Shop catalog the other day looking at various crankbaits. And I saw one by Berkeley, and it's called Cat Scratch. So I thought, hey, that's a little bit different. Let's try that one. We're going to end up using three colors in it. We're going to use white, black, and red. And we're going to start out with Createx Pearlized White. Now the basic blue was white, but if I'm doing white, I want it to be pearlized white because I really like pearlized. To me, the pearlized really pops a little bit, gives that little extra luster. Maybe it's just me, and it really doesn't mean anything, but I like it, so that's what I'm putting on. All right, got the white on. Let me clean the gun out, and we'll move on. Okay, got all the white on. Now we're going to come back with the Createx Pearlized Black. We're just going to run black right down the very back, the way you usually do it, I guess. And that's it. We're going to come a little around the face. We want to get around the eyes a little bit. So now I'm going to shoot forward so I don't get black back in here. Just get it up in the face where I want it. Around that eye socket. There we go. All right, that's all for the black. Now, I'm going to take the heat gun and I'm going to dry this real good before we start working with the stencil. So let me get this good and dry. All right, we're going to move over to the helping hands while we're getting ready to do this. Now, when you're putting tape on, you're either going to have to cut that off, or in this case, I just kind of bent it over get the deal. I'm kind of just hanging on left-handed so I'm doing it backwards but I'm kind of pushing on here and I'm pushing on the other side. I won't be able to turn it all the way around for you. I'm pushing on the other side of the bill so I'm kind of squeezing the bill together and that allows me to hold this in place. I'm going to take the gun. Just going to hit it like that good. Make sure we hit it good and away we go. And there we are. All right. Let's go on the other side, flip him over. Now in this case, let me get back here, I'm going to move the clamp over to this side of the bill, bend him over, same way I got my tape bent in, I'm going to hold him in just like that, nice and tight against it. And get loose here. And there we go. There's that side. Now, one last thing. And put that back on. I'm going to turn him over. And a little bit here on the throat. And that will finish him off. There you go. That is Cat Scratch by Berkeley. Well, roughly anyway. We'll get some eyes. I think the red eye is in it. Put a top coat on. And we'll see where we stand. Well, there we go, guys. There's my version of the cat scratch. Using the stencil that I made last week. Hey, thanks for sticking with me. Subscribe to the channel if you would. Hope to see you again real soon.